So after that first moto, it was pretty hot and brutal out there. Um, I had trouble uh, with my goggle lens. Um, I was running up front, I was running 11 for a while, and um, being up front with those fast guys, the, the roost is definitely a lot harder. I had trouble with my lens, it popped in. Um, got a bunch of dirt in my goggles. Uh, I was riding the majority of the race uh, blind, which kind of sucked. Um, when you're going into corners blind and doing the jumps, kind of closing your eyes, hoping no dirt gets in your eyes. Uh, it really makes you ride a lot more tense, a lot, it makes you hold on a lot tighter. So. Getting tired, man. I uh, like passed like Raiden and a couple of those fast guys, and I'm just not used to it, so I pumped up right away. But, you know, I can't complain. First race out of the way, uh, go from here. After the moto, just kind of took my helmet off, rode my uh, bike back to the trailer. When I got there, uh, I was kind of ungeared. Um, sat there in the shade. I didn't have the luxury of a air-conditioned room like the factory guys. What was really cool is uh, my dad, he is going to be able to fly to every race to help mechanic for me. And that's probably the sickest thing anyone can ask for because I'm sitting there in the heat trying, trying to calm down and, and not have to worry about getting my bike ready for the next race. Anything and everything that needs to be done to the bike, he does everything he can in his power. So um, after that, um, I just kind of threw on a new set of One Industries gear and got my goggle situation all figured out. And uh, after that, regrouped and got in the gate for the second moto. Got a good rest and um, you know, after the break, now we just get, for the, get ready for the next race. Thank you.